Namaste. I am Dr. Nischal, practicing as a consultant dermatologist at Nirmal Skin and Hair Clinic, Vijayanaga, Bengaluru. Greying in early age is called as premature canitis. Why does it happen? Basically, there is a problem in the production of melanin in the hair root. So, the hair follicle not only produces the keratin containing cells, but it also produces melanin containing melanin pigment. And this pigment is actually transferred to the hair shaft. So whenever the melanin production or the cells which produce them, that is the melanocyte gets affected, naturally the melanin content in the hair shaft comes down. And that gives you a grayish look to the hair. Why does it happen? It can happen because of genetic tendencies. There are a lot of genetic conditions like piebaldism, some syndromes where people can have reduced production of melanin and this can give rise to varying colors of the hair. It need not be always white, it can be reddish brown, it can be very reddish brownish in color. So these color variations can happen because of a genetic disturbance in the production of melanin. Second aspect is it can be because of free radical damage. So how are these free radicals produced in the body? Whenever there is a chemical reaction, lot of molecules are liberated which may not be beneficial. So something like a hydroxyl group. So there are lot of molecules which are nascent and which are damaging to the cells. So these are called as free radicals. Whenever these free radicals are produced more and if the body is not able to handle it, naturally it causes damage to the cells. Color producing cells are much more sensitive to all these damages when compared to the normal regular skin or hair producing cells. So whenever there is a damage, this is the first cell to get influenced. So that is why the color changes are noticed very soon. Stress, lack of sleep and improper diet patterns can increase this free radical damage. So that is why lot of importance is nowadays given to lifestyle changes. And what can prevent this free radical damage? That is your antioxidants. So whatever these oxidants are there, you try to reduce it with antioxidants. So what are these antioxidants? Your antioxidants are your vitamin A, C, E and also all other flavonoids. So all these molecules are present in green leafy vegetables, carrot, tomato, fruits, lot of vegetables. So vegetables and fruits are loaded with antioxidants, please have them. Second is omega-3 fatty acids. Omega-3 fatty acids also have a lot of antioxidant property and they are present in walnut, flax seeds and seafoods. So especially uh, salmon, tuna and sardine fish are loaded with omega-3. So these things also help to reduce the free radical damage. Beyond this, what are the other causes? We don't know. So that is why treating a premature canitis, that is the early graying of hair is very difficult when compared to treating hair fall as such. So as of now, the treatment options for the graying hair is very limited. The success is not so great. Hence, we always advise people who come to us with premature graying to have a very good lifestyle pattern. That may help to arrest the process of graying and also sometimes when the free radical damage is reversed, they tend to darken again. Hence, take care of your lifestyle. Rest, we'll see you.